Now I just made these two propellers. If you want to see, it was in a recent video. And a few people have asked about the spiral shape that I used. Let me uh, go over that real quick. All right, so what is the point of these fancy spirally things I made? Why don't I just use flat propeller blades or like what I usually do, which is just like bend a piece of metal to like approximate this shape. Well, when you actually get a good spiral, it has uh, an effect that I'm going to attempt to demonstrate right now. All right, so the spiral turn would be turning through the water, right? Now let's pretend this is some of the water. Let's put it here. And as it rotates, notice that it moves the water up all at the same rate. Get out of here, fly. So, yeah, to get that view. So as this turns, it's moving the water all at the same speed, right? Now, if my propeller blades were not a really good spiral shape, it would move the water, you know, at a different at different rates. Now, why is that important? Oh, and if you need fancy terms. When it's all moving at the same rate, you end up with laminar flow. Uh, and if it's not moving all at the same rate, you end up with turbulent flow. So anyway, what are these laminar, laminar flow and turbulent flows? What's, what's important about them? Okay, so in laminar flow, you have all the water being pushed back at the same rate. So it all kind of, kind of stays straight and going in the right direction, right? Now, with turbulent flow, if you've got if you have the water moving at different rates, this there's going to be this part of water is going to end up having a low pressure zone right there because it's moving slower than this part. So this part is going to end up curling in to fill in some of that space, and you're going to end up with a whole bunch of little eddy currents, they're called, a whole bunch of little tiny tornadoes. So you end up wasting a lot of energy from your propeller stirring up the water which is not that useful if you're trying to go somewhere. All right, how was that? Did you understand what I was talking about? Talk. Oh. All right, my esteemed assistant here wanted me to show what would happen with a flat propeller blade. So let's do that. All right, here's my pivot point, and this would be turning like this, right? So let's put our water here and see what happens. So you can see the, uh, the part further away from the center is moving much faster than the middle. And so you end up getting water tumbling around like this instead of just going. So you end up wasting a bunch of energy. Now, another thing about these, these specific spiral shapes, the, the ones I specifically made, is that I didn't make them, uh, I didn't keep the same pitch the whole way up. So I glued a bunch of pieces of wood together and the space, the space from this one to this one, oh, I backed myself into a bad grammatical corner. Okay, as I glued them together, I increased the distance here by a couple millimeters on every one. So this one's one distance, this one's a couple more millimeters more, this one's a couple millimeters further and further and further. So instead of just going up in a straight spiral, it ends up curving a little bit. I'm exaggerating with my hand, but it, it makes like a foil shape. Now, another benefit of that that I wasn't thinking about at the time was that allows me to make to make different pitch propeller blades. Uh, I've got this baby here. He's ridiculous. Okay, so, so <laughs> since this varies in pitch, I can pick any spot along here and get a different pitch propeller blade. Now, next time I make these, I'm going to make it keep going like all the way down until it gets to like ridiculously high pitch. And up here, I'm going to make it keep going lower and lower until it, the pitch is almost flat. So that way, I can pick anywhere along this whole curve to pick different pitches to make to make all kinds of different Don't. pitch propellers Don't get just with one spiral. Not for you. And that's great stuff. What is this baby doing? <laughs> yeah, like I, I still want off. that, dude. <laughs> I have a... Interrupting baby. <laughs> Interrupting baby. Oh, you, yeah, you give it. Also, I gotta say, the silver paint is pretty nice.